What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Demos Gaming and today we're playing 7 Days to Die with the mod 45 ACP Weapons by Izeo. Oh Izeo. Izeo. You've given us a real treat with this one, haven't ya? So if you've been following the channel for a little while, you'll know that I've already done two other videos on Izeo's weapons. One was, I think, on uh, 30-06 weapons. Uh, the most recent one was on 556 weapons. And now Izeo has released a third mod pack with all 45 ACP weapons. You got four handguns four SMGs, there are several different ammo types, there's actually parts to make one of the weapons, and then tons of really cool looking schematics. I, you know, I, the sounds, once again, sounds are really, really good. The gun models look really cool. Let's hop into it and let's check them out, shall we? So the first weapon that we have here, which I actually need to reload, it does have, I think, the same reloading animation for the pipe pistol, I believe. Yeah, I wonder if there's a way to speed that up a little bit. But, I mean, it's still, it looks pretty realistic for the gun. It looks good, I'd have to say. But this is the, the Webley, maybe it's pronounced Weebly 45 re revolver. If I remember correctly from the description, this one uh, is like a British revolver or something like that. But anyway. Oh, yeah. Real beefy sounds. I really like that for sure. Let's go ahead and uh, we're gonna bring in some zombies. By the way, I do have SMX HUD installed. I currently have this mod pack that I've been working with for a while that has a bunch of different mods installed. So it probably looks a little bit crazy right now. So bear with me. Let's uh, get a Marlene Farrell or Arlene Farrell. Nope, I don't even think I hit her. Why are you running like that? <laughs> Damn. All right, that's all it took, and this was a level three. So really, really nice revolver here, I'd have to say. Uh, the next one is, let's see, I think this is just a standard 1911. Yeah, Colt M1911, um, like World War II gun, you know, typical. Oh yeah, oh yeah, good stuff, good stuff. So let's, uh, let's get another zombie here to test this on. Let's try a biker, yeah, biker feral. Oh! <coughs> Ho, 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 popped his head. Perfect. So yeah, this one's pretty nice. Level four right now. Um, but yeah, it, it only takes six rounds. I am kind of wondering, in fact, let me see here if possibly the magazine extender mod will work for this. I'm not, I'm not sure. I don't even know if the magazine extender mod works on pistols at all in like vanilla seven days. Like, oh, it does work. Oh, cool. Okay, so how many can you carry now? So I get it up to like... Oh, it gives it, uh, makes it 10. Wow, Jesus. That would be a hell of, like, a, <laughs> a mag. I feel like I'd be hanging out at the end of the gun at that point. But, uh, yeah, okay, so that's that's good to know that you can, if you have the magazine extender mod, you can put it on this, give yourself an extra couple rounds. Because this thing, it packs one hell of a punch. I will say that. Let's... Fuck that hay. All right, so the next one, this one is just a level two. So I wanted to try them all at like various different levels just to kind of see like how much damage they do. But this one's the MK23 SOCOM. Kind of looks like a tactical style pistol. A little bit smaller frame. Nice like beefy sound on that for sure. Okay, I like that. All right, that sounds good. Let's go ahead and get something to shoot at here. Let's try a, um, let's try a radiated businessman actually and kind of see how well. Okay, all right, was able to take him out. This one's only a level two, but was able to take out a radiated feral there. That's pretty good. Uh, so, okay, really nice pistol there. In fact, while we're trying some different things out here, let's also try some of the different ammo types. So there is a 45 ACP overloaded and then an armor piercing. Let's go ahead and try the overloaded. I think basically the difference between these two ammo types is this is just the standard. I love this picture, by the way. This is, this is great. Big punch 45 ACP. That looks really cool. So that's that. Now, this is the overloaded. And, okay, what's the damage? Uh, so... Block damage is 8, 45 is the range damage. So this actually has a little bit extra block damage and 15 more range damage. That's good. So this um, should do a little bit better. Let's actually try that. Um, let's try the same radiated businessman. Uh, let's try and get him to run straight at us here. 
Bam. Okay. All right. <laughs> I was probably just missing him a lot, but yeah. Okay. So that works. Uh, that works quite well. Let's actually try just a standard. Um, do we have any? Yeah. Let's try a zombie Darlene here. She did. So that works. That works. I like it. All right. So next on the list is a really special pistol here. So this one is the Eagle Six. Now, I think. If I remember correctly in reading, I don't believe you can find these in loot or at the traders at all. I think what you have to find, you actually have to find the parts for this. There are four different parts. There is what appears to be the barrel, uh, the frame, um, the magazine, and then the, uh, the little scope. Okay, and, and once you have all the parts, then you can actually put this thing together. So here's the question. What do you need... Uh, so it's actually unlocked under Gunslinger, or you can find the schematic, okay? So, yeah, so you, this is unlockable. You can actually eventually get it with the Gunslinger perk, or, you know, you have to actually have that schematic to unlock it. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Listen to that fucking pistol sound. Oh, shit, yeah, I think that second shot killed him. I mean, they're both headshots. Let's try, uh, let's try a biker, let's try a radiated biker here. Jeez. Okay. That really didn't take much to take him down. I was mainly hitting him in the body, too, so that's pretty dope. All right, so yeah, this weapon's really, really nice. Same thing, I think you could probably, you could probably put a magazine extender. Oh, whoops, that's the, get the fuck out of here. That's the schematic. Um, you'd probably put a extender mod on this, maybe. Let's find out. Yep, so the extender mod does work for this as well. And let's reload it and see how many we have. Uh, so we, this can take 11 now. That's actually much better. And this pistol I, it would be so great to have just w walking around because it probably one-shots a lot of zombies. Okay. Doesn't one-shot a feral. It's... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Two shots him. I mean, that works for me. And um, actually, this one takes its own ammo type. This one specifically uses the 45 enhanced ammunition. I don't think any of the other guns use that ammunition specifically, and it already does like 72 damage compared to um, the big this um, overloaded that does 60. Also does more block damage too. So really, really nice pistol there. It's almost like having a little tiny shotgun with the kind of damage that it does. So good shit. I like it. Now we get into the SMGs here. This is a fucking Mac 10, man. I love that. It's been a while since I've actually seen a Mac 10 in a freaking um, Seven Days to Die mod, but. Fuck yeah. I feel like a freaking LA gang member. <laughs> Let's get something kind of tough here to, to test this on. Yeah, fuck yeah. Hello, come on, sir. See if we can, see if we can hit your target. Damn, I'm missing that like crazy. Oh shit, that was a bad idea. <laughs> this is a bad idea. Yep, go ahead and blow up. <laughs> Okay, that was just stupid. Let's... Fuck me, man. <laughs> Let's test this out on, on a... Yeah, Burnt Feral. Why not? Works. Good. Yeah, good enough for me. Good enough for me. <laughs> so Mac-10 uh, works quite well here. And then the frickin' Tommy gun, man. Yeah, see? Yeah, we're gonna rob this bank here with the Tommy gun. And I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna shoot this... Mar radiated Marlene zombie and kill her, see? Yeah, listen here, doll face. Don't fuck with me again. Ya bitch. Ooh, okay, so the Tommy gun only, you can only use the armor piercing or the regular ACP, so it does not take that overload or the, was it overloaded? Overloaded. It doesn't take the overloaded ammo type. I do remember seeing Izeo mention something about that where he didn't want these to be too overpowered. So, like, I guess giving, you know, allowing you to use uh, that particular ammo type with the SMGs made them really, really powerful. So it, it makes sense why you wouldn't want to use that other ammo type. Um, it kind of screwed up game balance, I guess. But uh, anyway, okay, so that's the Tommy gun. Holds 19. Pretty good. And gun model looks great. 
Yeah, oh yeah, that looks good. So now the last, or the second to last one that we have here is the SMPX. This one's actually a pretty nice fucking gun. I'm assuming, yeah, only uses those two, so that's fine. Uh, holds 27, so let's let's get something, let's get something to shoot here. Uh, let's try something else. Let's try a zombie lumberjack radiated, sure, why the hell not? All right, so I just unloaded on his ass and he's dead as fuck. So, okay, so this this works quite well, I'd have to say. In fact, let's see, um, to get a little bit of a better zombie, let's get try the zombie hue feral here. Just testing out how many licks it takes to get to the center of his Tootsie Pop. That was like four, four or five. Okay, so that was pretty good. Um, all right, so, yep, really, really nice weapon there. And then, uh, last but not least, we're going to try out the Heckler & Coke UMP. Um, so... Oh, shit. <laughs> Need to reload. Um, yeah, good shit, I'd have to say. This gun is actually really, really powerful, too. I was just... When I was on my way through this POI... This is, like, one of my favorite POIs, by the way. If you've never actually seen this i'm not going to ruin it for you because i don't want you to know what the house looks like let's get a zombie fat cop feral all right Ooh. okay that actually didn't take much to take him down and i i don't think i hit him in the head every time either so as you can see this this gun is pretty fucking powerful let's let's see if we can just one shot the janitor Oh yeah, he did. <laughs> he did his shit. All right, so this is good. This is good stuff. Now what you all have been waiting for, the zombie lumberjack, the, the, the feral zombie lumberjack challenge. Let's give it a try, shall we? Uh-oh, switch. They're all gonna be coming up around here shortly. Holy shit. Oh my God. Holy fucking balls, man. Holy shit balls. Holy balls, I can't run. I can't run. Oh my god, I'm dead. <laughs> Once again, as we've all learned, <laughs> can't fuck with those zombie lumberjack perils. That was 45 ACP weapons by Zeo. Zeo, once again, huge thanks for... Oh, God, we have a bunch of random people walking around, don't we? Uh, once again, thank you so much for this mod. Uh, really, really enjoying all of these weapons, and it really kind of, like, reinvigorates Seven Days to Die. It just gives you some more options for weapons so you can really kind of feel a little more overpowered, even though 25 Lumberjack Ferals, still, that's pretty rough. Uh... Okay. Anyway, so I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like. And if you enjoy this kind of content, then absolutely explode that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. And in the meantime, if you find yourself in a situation where you are in the apocalypse and you're just surrounded by all kinds of strange looking... Man, sh sit down and shut up. Surrounded by all kinds of strange looking zombies in a strange little world and all that kind of thing, then get yourself some 45 ACP weapons. Try them out. Include the 556, include the 30 odd six, you know, give yourself plenty of weapons and ammunition and just take on the apocalypse. You know, in fact, maybe take on 25 more, you know, not that it, it wasn't bad enough the first time. Take them out, fucking take them out. Kill those motherfuckers. I don't think I killed a single one of them. Oh no, we killed a couple. We killed a couple. All right. So anyway, See you on the next episode. Peace out. Where the hell are all of you? Yeah, go ahead. You're not going to be able to get to me up here. It's going to make a damn bit of difference. Yeah, see? You can't get me when I'm up high. Now you're just running around like a bunch of stupid ants. You don't even know what you're doing anymore. Hey, don't beat up my barn, man. This is just rude. Bunch of assholes. All right, fuck this. Come on. Let's do this shit. Uh oh, shit.
God damn it, there's still a lot of them. What the hell? Where, and where did she come from? She's actually helping me. I didn't realize that. I was kind of shooting at her. Or him. Whatever. Thanks, guys. Appreciate the appreciate the help. I don't know where you were a couple of minutes ago, but whatever. Fuck off! Jesus. <laughs> 